guys, this is a review for Raw on the 13th of September. Starts off with a special guest, I haven't got a clue who he was. He announces that it's a Raw Roulette, which is basically a big uh, board where you choose whether you get to the, the choose of the match for you. Uh, then he gets interrupted by the Miz, who starts taking out of the team he plays for. The GM emails and says it's time to find out what kind of match Miz will have and it lands on a submission and the GM gives a special guest a choice of Miz's opponent he chooses Daniel Bryan but about midway through the match Miz fakes an injury and gets Alex Riley to fight instead when next, uh, Alex Riley ends up tapping out and losing the match then the Miz attacks Daniel Bryan only to be countered and tap out by the Bell lock Next is a couple of really short matches, which is basically from Edge and both of them. Edge versus Evan Bourne first in the body slam match, but he spears Evan Bourne after he's won. So the GM contacts him and says that he's got another match and it ends up being against Mark Henry, who Mark Henry wins in like five seconds. They announce that John Cena and Randy Orton's match is going to be a table match, and then um, R Truth and Eve and Ted Diabasi and Maurice have a sing and dance match and basically R-Truth and Eve are really good and then uh, Ted Diabasi is like oh I can sing better because I'm hoping to see clips and he ends up being crap but then Diabasi attacks uh, well they both attack the other team but they both get beaten up in the end next they announce two more matches one beating Gold Dust versus William Regal in a trading places match, which is basically Gold Dust has to dress up like William Regal and William Regal has to dress up, dress up like Gold Dust. And then Sheamus versus John Morrison, and it turns out to be a false count anyway. They have the Sheamus versus John Morrison match first before the Regal match, and basically it's a good match, but at the end Chris Jericho comes out and ruins it for Morrison by hitting him with a chair and uh, Sheamus, top, um, Sheamus getting a 1, 2, 3 on him. Chris just sits in the ring. Uh, he finally says that he's not moving until he's reinstated back into the six pack challenge at the Night of Champions or he's quitting. So the GM replies that if he wants to get back in the match he has to win a handicap match against Heart Dynasty in the steel cage. One of the Heart Dynasty gets over the top of their steel cage straight away, but the other one ends up tapping out after like a five minute fight. The next match was really, really short. It was William Regal vs. Goldust. And basically it's like a five second thing. They, they came out, someone made a joke that Regal looks like the Joker, and then Goldust hits him with the, with the brass knuckles. The next match was John Cena vs Randy Orton, it was really good. At the end Nexus interfered only to have one arcade, one attitude adjustment and three thrown through a table. Next Edge and Dick Jericho come down to the ring to interfere, but eventually Edge accidentally puts Jericho through the table by spearing him. And then finally Sheamus gets, comes down and ends up getting a attitude adjustment. And Cena tries doing the same to Randy Orton, but Randy changes it into an RKO through the table to win. That was it for today. Raw was actually really good this week compared to other weeks. We had fun, and please subscribe if you want the rest, and I do other videos. So, yeah, bye.